Mr Ian Murray. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Can I pay tribute to my Red Honourable Friend in the way in which he's chaired the Foreign Affairs Committee in the first few months he's had that position, and indeed to the Minister for the candid way in which he presented the case of the UK Government when he spoke uh, to give evidence to the Committee. But I wonder if we could ask uh, my Red Honourable Friend, the Chair of the Committee, if he thinks that this again shows the bluntness of the UN and shows that they don't have enough tools available to them to deal with these kinds of international crises. Uh, my honourable friend, and I do refer to him as a friend and a fellow member of the committee, uh, speaks very clearly and identifies his own views on, on the UN. This is not a subject we've yet looked upon, and as I'm responding on a particular report, I don't think it would be appropriate for me to stray into uh, the structure of the United Nations. However, I would urge uh, the Minister to work through the United Nations system to make sure that reports like the Annan Commission are indeed fully implemented, as indeed he will remember from our time in the committee we all supported.